Hello, ladies and gentlemen, yo, welcome to Ryback Has Heat. We've rebranded the show where, where is we creating new content here on Ryback TV. Um, the Big Guy versus Food is now going to be feeding time, feeding time, uh, debated naming it feeding time, bitches, but I thought maybe bitches was a little bit too much. I feel like you don't want to call your audience bitches. Um, even though I'm sarcastic 99% of my life, which some people still don't understand that. But when I'm serious for that 1%, damn it, am I, I'm, I'm just serious as it gets. So, today guys, I'm, uh, I'm gonna be doing, uh, five peppers today. Or I have five peppers in front of me. Show us the peppers! Ah, uh, take it easy there, Tom, Dick, and Harry. The, uh, these are the peppers, guys. I'm not a pepper expert. I just know Johnny Scoville from Chase the Heat. Give him a follow here on YouTube if you want to watch a real heat legend. I'm a rookie. This is my rookie season, guys. Granted, do I think I'm going to win rookie of the year in this game? I, I really do. Hell yeah, I'm going for rookie of the year. The League of Heat. I, I got to be the, the hottest newcomer on the scene. And, uh, you know, but, uh, I'm doing a lot of things. So this is kind of just more for fun for me, but I don't know the names of all the peppers. I apologize the week before I called the chocolate Buddha pepper, the chocolate, chocolate Bootla pepper, chocolate Bootla pepper, the chocolate Buddha pepper. I just didn't care to look it up before. I could have looked it up really easily on my phone, but I just didn't want to. And I figured it'd be funny if I, and so I was like, no, it is chocolate bootla though. So I thank you for the people that corrected me on that. I believe we have, we have a, definitely have at least one Carolina Reaper in here. And I believe we have a death spiral pepper, um, in here as well. This is some sort of orange. This I feel like isn't the hottest of all of them. I could be wrong. I'm going to attempt, I'm going to cut these, uh, the ends off and cut them in half and I'll show you guys. Uh, and then I'm just gonna go through and I'm gonna eat them. And uh, we'll kind of, we'll take a little bit of time in between each one, not too much, cause you know, I wanna go for a 30 minute video on this. But uh, I got my nice ring light. DJ Dell suggested I get one cause some people, I, I know with the lighting in the house on some of the videos, depending on where I record at, the lighting could be, uh, God, the lighting is horrible, the glare really bothers some people so I don't want to I don't want to bother people guys I just want to eat some hot peppers here with my nice little ring light and uh go from there appreciate everybody over 150,000 subscribers now I think we're getting close to 155 actually so thank you very much um as I'm just gonna go ahead and cut these real quick I want to be careful not to get this stuff in my eyes or on my, even on my hands. Um, and I got the dogs, little guy and Sophia. I got to take them for a walk later. Hopefully this doesn't destroy me. I was uh, completely fine after last week's challenge. The almond milk, I'm sure, really, really helped with that. I didn't know I wanted to, I was making a protein shake and I figured, you know, I look back and I go, you know what, well, water would have been maybe a little um, better to mix it with, but Again, this stuff is, this is just a weekly challenge, trying different things on the spice. Eating these fresh peppers um, here just straight up. I don't know how many I'm gonna be able to do. I know I, Scoville uh, had mentioned to me about people eating the peppers and purging and throwing up after a certain amount because you just can't eat a, a ton and digest them. Typically, it's too much for most people's stomachs. I don't think five would be that amount. I don't know though. And the heat's gonna amplify with these tremendously. So we're just gonna have to kind of see see what happens. I'm um, talked to the UK chili queen. She said she's gonna eat like 120 something peppers. And I just, it's, I, I just go like, it's just a one time thing. And then that hopefully never do that again, but that's 120, I think, Reaper peppers. So, 
I'm, uh, I'm almost done here, guys. Just bear with me. And I know there's somebody watching. Um, and I, guys, again, I love all of you guys, even the people that leave negative comments. I do block you from the channel or um, hide you from the channel. Hide loser is what I like to say. It says hide user. I say hide loser. Just because if you want to try to make somebody feel bad with bad comments. But the I love everybody, guys. Even we, we I make fun of the negative comments because it's, it's, it's fun to be entertaining. It's really hard to like take good comments and be entertaining with them. Like, Ryback, you're so awesome. Like, I can't. I can't make anything funny about that. And then, like, I just sounded like a conceited asshole just even saying that right now. So it's just easier to, like, make fun of yourself and laugh at what people say. Like, right now with this ring light, like, I could tell my big forehead is standing out. And then somebody's like, <laughs> Pick them right back. <laughs> big forehead. <laughs> it's, it's steroids. <laughs> Human growth hormone. <laughs> Like that just happened with like three users during this. And guys, just so you're aware, I've had a big forehead my entire life. My father has the same forehead. I think mine might be a little more pronounced, especially after I went with the shaved head. My nickname in high school though was Shelf by a guy on the baseball team, this guy named Matt, if I'm not mistaken. He was a pitcher, a little skinny guy, but he was a nice guy. He goes, man, you got a big forehead. And I said, yeah. Great for headbutts, and uh, but for however, whatever reason, we started call. I call it like I don't know if I came up with it or there. Or someone goes, man, it's like a shelf, and I just was like, that was like kind of like my funny nickname with a few friends on the team, shelf. So, and I mean, I was in high school and I was senior year. I was got up to two hundred and forty pounds. Guys, no, didn't even know what a steroid was or anything. Like it's so. It's none of that, guys. It's just all take it easy. I'm just cutting a couple more of these in half. Oh, the smell of the peppers sometimes makes me a little sick because I can smell the heat. Oh, that chocolate bootla doesn't, it looks like it's gonna cause some, a lot more. I don't know if I'm gonna do all five, guys. I'm not, I'm not bitching out yet. Like, I, I think I did four with Scoville. We did three on the, the episode of Johnny Scoville before. And, uh... Then, uh, we did one... I did one on the podcast. We did two, though, that were pretty tame. Which I'm hoping that orange one is somewhat tame. I'm, uh... I'm just gonna eat them with my knife so I don't have to put my fingers on them. I didn't bring, uh fork over here and I don't want to, I want to stay on camera guys you know <sighs> you guys ready for this Ryback has heat don't really know what to expect <clears throat> oh boy. So that orange one was, um, Ooh. 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 it was way hotter than I was expecting. I normally have a peanut butter sandwich before this banana with some ginseng. I take little sips of water, guys. The water is a necessary thing. Ooh, that gave me the hiccups, the herps. The burps and the hiccups. <coughs> oh, I hate it when he gives me the herps. Ooh. a lot of peppers guys three to four maybe the max but maybe mixing them up oh. all right I don't know which
which one this is. It's another pepper though. I like the mental challenge. Oh boy. You guys want to send stuff too? challenges to the channel you can send it to p.o box 752-740 las vegas nevada 89136 just to make sure it's sealed so you don't try to do something to kill me um i know the mad dog plutonium has been mentioned i've been advised not to do that by a lot of people including johnny scoville i know it really messed up the bell life brothers Liquids, guys, I'm not drinking any milk or anything. I don't like the taste of peppers too much, so I'm not going to lie. All right. That one wasn't um, too bad, but we'll see. Whew. I don't know which one this is. Could be the Reaper, could be the Death Spiral. I don't know. It's a limp. That's what she said. <laughs> uh. Oh, la 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 la. Oh, dude, got my C.T. Fletcher shirt on. Peppers, we got some kick to them, guys. You can tell, definitely. Get that pepper taste out of my mouth. Yeah. I laughed. Somebody told me on one of my, the, uh, the, the Popeye's Burger King Wendy's chicken sandwich video that it was apparent that I was letting myself go. Oh, that one has some heat later here. Son of a bitch. Whew. That one hit me in the throat. Right in the back of the throat. Oh, is that a reaper? Is that a reaper, guys? Oh. Ah, definitely. Definitely feel that one. What we're going to do next is the chocolate bootla. Because I don't know... If I'm going to do the fifth, we're going to see. Because four is essentially doing the four hot ones would be the most that I've ever done. I'm just about making small progressions on this. And increasing my threshold as we go on. Testing my limits. We'll see though. Ooh, that one crept up on me bad. <laughs> right back as he... Whew. Man, that one was delayed burn like a mother. Somebody told me, though, it was apparent that I was getting a gut and let myself go. And I just laughed as I just posted a photo on IG on my abs. And uh, it's amazing that people... But he was able to tell from my workout videos that I had a huge gut. So, Tom, he had zero subscribers, which is fine, but he hasn't figured out. <laughs> Whew. What do you think, the chocolate bootla? <clears throat> Why am I asking you? By the time this comes out, I've already made my decision. <laughs> Ooh. I don't like the taste of pepper, so I can't stress that enough. 
All right, we'll try this chocolate boot. Let's see. Ooh. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh man, guys, what do you think? You think maybe do the last ones? Whew. I just don't want to get, I don't like it when I get the, uh, the cramps or anything like that with this. And I have to piss right now. You know what guys, part of being a pepper eater, I think is being smart. I don't feel horrible right now. I still got a lot of work to do. Ooh. I'm trying to decide if I want to do that last pepper. Uh, what do you say we do four and a half? Compromise. Ooh. Oh, that chocolate bootleg crept up on me again. <sighs> this definitely is by far the hottest peppers I've done eating the four of those together. Whew. I don't like... Yeah, I think we're going to play it safe tonight. I want to do these videos for a long time. I have one left, which we'll save. I, have, I think that one was the Reaper, if I'm not mistaken, or it was the, the Death Spiral one. But we got more of those, so we'll do that one next time. I want to see how these settle in me on doing the four strong ones and see... Ooh, because they amplify on top of each other, too. That Death Nut Peanut Challenge was by far the worst, so. The heat, that just... Definitely intense, so. We're going to keep it going a little bit longer. Life creates life energy... What is it? Energy creates energy. Life life begets life. Energy creates energy. The more you spend yourself, the more you get. I love that quote. I always take it as the harder you work, the harder you apply yourself, the more you get out of life. I have it hanging up. I think I talked about that last week. I love that quote, though. If you guys have any suggestions on these, what you'd like to see me do next, let me know. Maybe try some other hot challenges. Uh, I'm always curious as my threshold goes up on this. Uh, my main thing is dealing with the stomach issues. And uh, so it doesn't ruin the whole night. And uh, just trying to, to get better at handling heat. And uh, fire. Uh, you can definitely see it though. Sinus has cleared up a little bit. Definitely red. Oh, it's cold here in Vegas right now, too. It's overcast. Oh, man. But yeah, Ryback has heat, guys. Not too bad. It was bad, though, but not too bad. It wasn't Death Nut Peanut bad. Check out Johnny Scoville, Chase the Heat. I'm a big fan of his. I'm the UK Chili Queen. She's on YouTube as well. She can handle a lot of heat. 
And uh, as I get better at this and keep improving, hopefully we'll do some more collaborations. Thank you again to The Bell Life for the shout out. And uh, hopefully do something with those guys pretty soon. And uh, just keeping at it. Got everything with Feed Me More Nutrition. Available on feedmemore.com and Amazon. My own natural supplement line, sweet with Stevia and Monk Fruit. 99% of the companies out there, guys. Use aspartame and sucralose. It has been proven time and time again, artificial sweeteners are bad for human beings. It doesn't make any sense to have them in supplements that are supposed to be for our health. Uh, but the business is driven solely on profits and cheap formulas, which is not what we are at Feed Me More Nutrition. Uh, and you can see that in the reviews and people enjoying the supplement. In my podcast, Conversation with the Big Guy Ryback. Available on all podcast platforms and here at Ryback TV. Your reviews, iTunes reviews are greatly appreciated. I love you guys. Thank you very much. And for all the dum dums, dum 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 dum, right back, da da. I love you guys too. I truly, truly uh, hope you guys find happiness and love much uh, as much as I have, and enjoying myself and uh, getting healthy and strong again after the 14 stem cell procedures, and uh, getting myself back and, and rebuilding my body <coughs> as my business is growing and uh, expanding. And just uh, sharing my life here on YouTube now that I'm healthy. So thank you guys very much. And uh, we're going to get to a million subscribers. It's going to be a cool thing. And we're going to go far past that. This is just the beginning. Be good human beings, guys. I appreciate you very much. Get hungry. Stay hungry. Feed me more. Thank you guys very much for watching Ryback TV. If you could smash that subscribe, hit that like button, share this channel, and for Feed Me More Nutrition on feedmemore.com, save 10% with Podcast 10, click here for my podcast conversation with the big guy Ryback, available on all podcast platforms. Click here. And for more videos of yours truly on Ryback TV, click here. Feed me more.